So you ask what are the top three features of the Think Fat Town? I'd say it's first, the mobility, second, the fact that it's just windows, and third, the fact that uh, it comes with a great pin that allows for extensions and, abil and the, uh, the ability to really interact with your device in a natural and comfortable way. So when it comes to mobility, this is a 10.1 inch device, less than 10 millimeters, uh, it's less than 10, uh, uh, it's under 600 grams, and it uh, gives over 10 hours of battery life. It's a, so from a mobility standpoint, it's a great experience for people that want to take a tablet with them on the go. Um, when it comes to Windows, and it just being Windows, the desktop environment, um, as well as the Windows 8 application environment, gives you two great opportunities and ways to interact with software and with your content, your social networks, and other and other um, things that you want to do. So when it comes to the new Windows 8 apps, you get this immersive experience, these great apps that open up, whether it's pictures or photos or mail or the People app uh, that comes up. Um, when it comes to the desktop experience, you have all your traditional and familiar applications, whether it's Word, PowerPoint, Excel, or OneNote, or if you're working in an enterprise or in a, in a corporation, you have Outlook, you have Microsoft Link for communication, you have SharePoint for, um, for your online storage and sharing files between different people. You even get iTunes and Safari, um, you know, for people that are on, that have iPhones or that are on, that have their, their music in iTunes. You can access that music and play it off of this tablet in a way that it makes it seamless. So that ability is, is it's unheard of when it comes to tablets and really opens the opens the game and makes for a great experience. Um, addition, in addition to that, you get peripherals. You have, there's a USB port on this device that allows you to access basically any accessory that uses a USB port, whether it's a USB thumb drive, whether it's a um, sorry, whether it's a USB thumb drive. Let's go back. The peripherals in the USB port is really makes for great experience because you can access your USB thumb drives, your smart, uh, your external DVD ROM drives, your external cameras, printers, uh, monitors, basically anything that works on Windows 7 will work on Windows 8. Um, and then the third point, again, is the pen. The pen really create, allows for uh, writing and a great writing experience when it comes to taking notes as well as marking up documents. I can think of a number of great use cases and scenarios if I'm a consultant and I get a PowerPoint presentation from one of my colleagues. If I want to provide feedback, I can take the PowerPoint, ink it up, cross out certain images that I don't, that I don't think are relevant, or add in text and give examples of, that I think they should use, send it back, and it's very easy for them to give feedback on. Um, if I'm a student working in math, engineering, or sciences, the ability to write equations, to derive formulas, to really learn by drawing diagrams, it's unprecedented as far as the ability. You can't do that with a keyboard. You can't do that just with your finger. A pen really makes it more usable and a better experience. And for those three reasons, the ThinkPad tablet, for me, is the tablet that people have been waiting for. It's the tablet that combines the best of both worlds. It gives you the best of a PC and the best of a tablet.